Hi, I'm Michelle Marchand Canseco. Lecture is the easiest, fastest way for you to learn something. That doesn't mean that you're going to remember it. That might whew, go right out of your head. So you want to figure out ways that you're going to take that information from short-term memory, transfer it into long-term memory, and have it plant itself in a part of your brain where your access to it is immediate. How do you do that? Intermittent repetition. Advertisers know this. That's why they make sure that the way we see their commercials is in an inter mittent fashion. What am I talking about? You have the show, the commercial, the show, the commercial, the show, the commercial, the show, the commercial. So basically what happens is your information that you're getting from that commercial is in short-term memory, but because it keeps getting repeated in an intermittent way, it transfers itself into long-term memory and plants itself in a part of your brain where your access to it is immediate. Let me give an example. Okay, if I sing ba da ba ba ba, what is the brand? Okay, and can you give me the slogan, the catchphrase after that little tune? Okay, if you can do that, then the other thing I want to ask you is what's the visual in your head? And are you tasting anything in your mouth? That's when they know they've been really successful is when you're using all the senses and they've really captured you. That is intermittent repetition. Now, how can you apply this when you're studying? Believe it or not, studying in, and giving yourself the most advanced time frame is your best bet. So index cards can be really can work out really well for you. Why? Because you're continually looking at them in an intermittent fashion. You look at the index card, I don't know, you're driving, you're looking at it at a red light. You're looking at it while you're stuck in traffic. You're looking at that little index card. I'm sure there's an application on your phone that you can do this with. There are um, audio clips that you can make for yourself and many smartphones also have the capability of recording your voice, recording your teachers if they'll allow you to do that. So it's that intermittent fashion when you're continually studying throughout the day. So pulling the all-nighters works. I'm not going to deny you that because you've probably done it and you studied all night, you maybe stayed up all night and you didn't study uh, one iota before that, but the night before the test you studied and then you retained the information for the test. I'd love to give you that test three weeks later. I don't think you would be able to pass that test. Why? Because it never made the transfer from short-term memory into long-term memory. So if you need this information, you're going to be tested on it again, you want to study in an intermittent way.